In this lecture, we are going to study different types of energy like renewable and non-renewable energy. Let us begin with basic introduction to energy types. There are many forms of energy. Common energy forms include kinetic energy of a moving object and radiant energy carried by light. Thermal energy comprises of microscopic kinetic and potential energies of disordered motions of particles. Renewable energy is generally defined as energy that comes from resources which are naturally replenished on human time scale such as sunlight, wind, rain, tides, waves and geothermal energy. A non-renewable source is a source that does not renew itself at a sufficient rate of sustainable economic extraction. The original organic material with the aid of heat and pressure become a fuel such as oil or gas. Example of non-renewable energy is fossil fuel such as coal, petroleum and natural gas. Let us learn different types of energy. Here, let us begin with nuclear energy. Nuclear particles like proton and neutrons are not destroyed in fission or fusion process. A few lighter particles may be created or destroyed but these minor processes are not important to the immediate energy release in fission or fusion. Does it provide the energy release from nuclear fission and nuclear fusion processes? Thermal energy is the energy associated with microscopically random motion of particles constituting the media. For example, in case of monoatomic gas, it is just a kinetic energy of motion of atom of gas as measured in the reference frame of center of mass of gas. Another form of energy is chemical energy. Chemical energy is defined as the work done by electric forces during rearrangement of mutual position of electric charges, electrons and protons in the process of aggregation. Basically, it is electrostatic potential energy of electric charges. What is electrical energy? Electrical energy is an energy derived from electrical potential energy. It is energy absorbed or delivered by an electrical circuit. This energy is supplied by the combination of electric current and electrical potential that is delivered by the circuit. Magnetic energy is the potential energy of a magnet of magnetic moment M in a magnetic field B is defined as the work of magnetic force on realignment of vector of the magnetic dipole moment. Lines are used to represent the force existing in the area surrounding a magnet. These lines called as magnetic lines of force. These lines are imaginary lines used to illustrate and describe the pattern of a magnetic field. What is sound energy? Sound is a form of mechanical vibration which propagates through any mechanical medium. The wide outer area of ear is maximized to collect sound vibrations. It is amplified and passed through the outer ear striking the eardrum which transmits sound into the inner ear. Auditory nerves fire according to the particular vibration of sound waves in the e inner ear which designed such, a, such things as the pitch and volume of the sound. Another form of energy is mechanical energy. Mechanical energy is the sum of potential energy and kinetic energy. 
it is the energy associated with the motion and position of an object what is wind energy wind energy is the energy extracted from the wind using wind turbines to produce electrical power wind mills for mechanical power wind pumps for water pumping or sail to propel ships the effect of wind energy on the environment are generally less problematic than those from other power sources large wind farms consist of hundreds of individual wind turbines which are connected to the electrical power transmission network what is hydropower or hydro energy hydropower is a power delivered from energy of falling water and running water which may be harnessed for useful purpose water power is manifested in hydrology by the forces of water on the river bed or banks of a river Hydropower is used primarily to generate electricity. Broad categories includes a conventional dammed hydro facility is the most common type of hydroelectric power generation. Conventional hydroelectric referring to hydroelectric dams. Rubber of the river hydroelectricity hydro and hydro projects. Solar energy is the most readily available sources of energy. It is also the most important of non-conventional sources of energy because it is non-polluting and therefore helps in lessening the greenhouse effect. Solar energy can also be used to meet our electricity requirement. solar photovoltaic cell solar radiation gets converted into dc electricity directly this electricity can either be used as it is or can be stored in the battery the stored electrical energy then can be used at night the term biomass refer to organic matter that has stored energy through the process of photosynthesis it exists in one form as plants and may be transferred through the food chain to the animal bodies and their waste all of which can be converted from everyday human use through the process such as combustion which releases carbon dioxide stored in plant material biomass has become one of the most commonly used renewable source of energy in last two decades It is second only to hydropower in the generation of electricity. Biomass is one of the most plentiful and well utilized sources of renewable energy. Broadly speaking, it is organic material produced by the photosynthesis of light. Geothermal energy is the heat from the earth. It's clean and sustainable. Resources of geothermal energy ranges from the shallow ground to hot water and hot rock found a few miles beneath the earth's surface. Even deeper to the extremely high temperature of molten rocks which are called as magma. Hot water near the earth's surface can be used directly for heat. Direct use application includes heating buildings, growing plants in greenhouses, drying crops, heating water at fish farms and several industrial processes. What is fossil fuel? Fossil fuel are fuels formed by natural processes such as anaerobic decomposition of buried dead organism. Coal, oil and gas are called fossil fuels because they have been formed from the organic remains of prehistoric plants and animals the use of fossil fuels raises serious environmental concerns fossil fuels contain high percentage of carbon 
and include coal, petroleum and natural gas. Earth minerals and ores are some natural form of energy that are available in Earth's heart. Minerals and metal ores are other example of non-renewable resources. Their extraction by human occurs where they are concentrated by natural geological processes. These processes generally takes from tens of hundred thousand of million of million years through plate tectonics, tectonic subsidences and crust recycling. See you in the next session. Thank you.